Uh, Dallas, obviously whenever you play them, this is the most bitter rival, yeah, sorry, uh, most bitter rival this organization has. What is it like to play in those games, and what do you anticipate Saturday being like? Sure, it's going to be a dog fight either way. It's always nice. Um, just want to be a part of that history, you know what I mean? Um, it's always it's always bigger when you play well in these games, and that's always my goal. So, I mean, it's always exciting. I always look forward to it. And Changes uh, at all with Dak under center versus the last time you saw them? I mean, he's their guy. I mean, I don't, I don't, you know, I mean, I don't, I don't know. I, I really don't. <laughs> I don't worry about that. I just worry about my matchup and, uh, you know, just take it to practice and that's, that's it. I don't really worry about what he, what he got going on back there, but I mean, we already know great player. So got to be on it. All right. Last question. You guys are right now on pace to break the all time sack record for this franchise. And this is a franchise. I'm a little older than you. I remember Reggie White. I remember some of these guys. Like, what does it feel to be in that kind of company and potentially set that kind of history? I mean, it just goes to show, you know, all the work that we put in and um, how, how well we work together as a rush group. Um, I mean, it's great. You know, we won't, like I said, we don't really want to worry about that too much. We, we still got to win the games, but I mean, still, we want to know, you know, how well we've been doing. You know what I mean? And, you know, we got a lot more to do, but something we should be proud of. But we, we just got to make it happen. How are you feeling? How does it feel to be back? You know, I feel great. Um, I feel 100%. You know, I'm ready to go. I can't wait to uh, play Saturday. Uh, excited about this opportunity, Cowboys, that's mm -hmm. the spotlight? Yeah, you know, I'm treated like a, another game. You know, I'm not going to, you know, believe in the hype, but, you know, I'm just going to go out there and uh, do what I do. So. You feel like you dodged the bullet a little bit? Oh, yeah, absolutely. You know, I, I'm blessed to be able to, you know, walk again. You know, it's kind of scary, but, uh, you know, I'm just, like I said, I'm ready for uh, Saturday. All right, so I want to talk to you about the uh, pass rush and obviously the success you guys are having right now. To what do you attribute that? Uh, our coaches and, um, and that's just being together. Um, we just work as a D line. If the inside getting a push, that means the quarterback can't step up, or if the uh, edge rush is coming, coming bending the corner, that means they they don't want to. Um, they step up to us. So I think I just contributed to everybody just working together. Uh, when you have a sack, whether it's you or BG or any of your guys, there's a sack celebration. Who's the best? Uh. I don't know. Well, it's it's mine. It's mine. It is mine. So it's mine. It's, 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 yeah, it's, it's mine because everybody, I think uh, it gets everybody involved. So when I when I draw off the door, everybody be running to come kick it with me. A lot of votes for that. How do you feel about the sweaty? Oh, sweaty, sweaty. It's, it's a natural because of his name. So it's, he, he, is, he is hard because of his name. And, uh, I guess you just know what he's doing. Obviously, it is Dallas week. Last time you guys saw them, second half, they were able to figure out the run game a little better. Uh, what do you feel like you saw, and what kind of adjustments do you think you'll make this time? Uh, we just got to be better on the run. Um, we just we know this is a big week. Um, it's a division game, and you know it's, it's for the NFC. NFC. Um, I don't know, the East, mm -hmm. yeah, the NFC East. So uh, I know it's going to be a big game, and uh, we can't wait to play it. Do things change with Dak under center compared to when you saw him last time? I mean, Dak's a great player, so we know it's going to be a little different. Um, I guess the game plan is going to be a little different, but we up for the challenge. You guys are going up against Gardner, I guess, a decent amount uh, on the scout team when he's running that offense for you. Over the course of this season, what have you seen out of him? I mean, Gardner, that's a great player. Uh, uh, like anybody else, um, Gardner, he he's always prepared, and we know he just like I said, he 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 a great player if we need him. What have you noticed about how he's getting the, the ball out? Do you feel like it's been on time generally, or what's you know from a pass rushing perspective? What have you, Ooh, what have you noticed? Yeah, going up against him on scout. Man, he just give a great look every time we play against him. Um, whatever the quarterback's doing to us, he. He just adjusts. If it's a running quarterback, he'll take off running, and he just do everything right. And you know, he just like I said, he a great player. You know, honestly, the the scheme each week is dependent on you know who we're playing. But uh, Coach Clay, Joe P, and Tyler all just I mean they they put a lot of work into putting us in the right situation you know to be successful. So this is just another week of that, and. Uh, I just feel that you know it takes time to kind of develop that synergy on a unit like kickoff return, you know, because it's gotten progressively harder over the years. So um, I just feel like we were, you know, we were on the same page, and um, all the guys were out there doing their job. It is a hard play in the NFL. It is a hard play. You know, it used to be back in the day. You know, you could put two <laughs> offensive linemen together, tell them to yell as loud as they can, and just run, and whoever gets in your way, you know drop them into the ground, but it's not like that anymore. It's like, you know, 
it's one on ones. You know what I'm saying? Depending on the scheme, you know, you got double teams here or there, but it's tough. You know, there's a lot of space for the coverage team to make moves, and there's twists, and there's all kinds of different games going on. So, you know, whenever whenever big plays happen, I mean, it's it's a unit thing. It's not any individual or one person. How much are you enjoying that role, though? Because obviously, offensively, it's going to be up and down for you. Yeah, I'm I'm enjoying it. You know, just trying to. I'm just happy to be able to contribute. That's all. Um, what do you think you did to earn that job? I uh, I mean, I, I don't know. I mean, you know, they, I guess they just wanted to put me back there and see what happens. So, uh, yeah. I mean, Why do you think you're good at it? Um, you know, I just think uh, speed. You know, you gotta you just gotta Use your speed, you know, trust the scheme, and, um, you know, try and make something happen. You know, you got to – I don't want to give out, you know, too many of our little bits of gold, but, uh, yeah, you just got to – you got to use your speed, you know, be deceptive. How different is the vision on that play as opposed to when you're running back? It's, it's, it's harder on kickoff return, you know what I'm saying, because you can, you can have an understanding of um, – you know how things are going to be blocked, and with kickoff return instead of five, you know what I mean. Blocking six or you know five or you know you have tight ends in and it might be seven blocking however many. Uh, it's a little different, you know. Now you're having to react uh, basically against ten matchups, so uh, it's a little different. So feel like you're close to breaking one for a score. Yeah, man. Yeah, the guys, the guys are working too hard, man. I got, we gotta, we gotta do one. We gotta get one. Last week playing safety, did it feel like old times? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Actually, back to my rookie days. Mm-hmm. Now, it was fun. Um, you know, just to get back there and Evans helped me out a ton. You know, getting back into the feeling of it and you know the teaching points. So. You know, big kudos to him. And you know, other than that, it was it was it was fun. Yeah. Did you feel like you still had it back then? Oh uh, yeah. I mean, it's, it's not too hard. Uh, it's almost kind of like played the same way as a nickel spot in mm-hmm. a certain way, but just a little bit different if you're in the back. Uh, this week, Cowboys CD plays a ton inside. How big of a challenge is that for you? No, uh, definitely a challenge. Um, I mean, as you know, he's one of the better receivers in the league, and you know, it'd be fun to you know, lining up against him and you know, competing. He's a, a tall guy. Um, what's the, the teaching points for you facing off against a guy who's that much bigger than you? Uh, I mean, not that much bigger. It's not playing. <laughs> uh, no, definitely, um, definitely um, got a height advantage. But, you know, it's all about, you know, making sure I'm in good position and good and playing violent at the attack of the ball when it's thrown. So, you know, that's my goal is for the most part. And, you know, just making sure, you know, keep him, keep him bracketed and, and, you know, stop him from getting the ball as much. Gannon was mentioning how good he is after the catch, after contact. Yeah. How aware of that do you have to be? Oh, definitely. I mean, you got to make sure you wrap him, get his legs, get him down. Um, he definitely breaks a lot of tackles when he's out there. And, you know, you got to stop the yak. You don't want him to get too much yards after the catch. And, you know, that would be a big emphasis this, this week as well. You guys have gone up against Gardner a lot of, as he's running the scout team offense this year. Yeah. What has uh, stood out about him? Uh, Gardner, he's that guy. <laughs> I mean, he – he, he he's he's amazing actually. I mean he he's a, he he prepares every single day. Um, you know I, I enjoy watching him. I'm always talking to him and you know going up against him and scout team. You know he always making these no look throws and <laughs> making it hard for a tough for us out there. So you know it's always been fun playing with him.